Dream Team, it's your boy D Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with uh, Only Fools and Horses from Prussia with Love. And uh, if y'all can find the season four Christmas special for me, uh, y'all can drop the link that I can watch that episode on. That would be absolutely awesome. I just do not. I, I looked for it for a little bit and I kind of gave up on it. So if y'all find it, let me know. But here we go. I'm excited to jump into this one. Where we go? Oh, it took me up too. Come on, don't hang on. Maureen, Maureen, go and tell that girl over there, will you? We're closing in a minute. And how am I supposed to do that? I've been trying to talk to her all night, but she's foreign. Don't understand the lingo. What's your current language? What's that foreign talk? She can't speak a word of English. She's been sitting here all night, keeps bursting into tears. Yeah, well, at your prices, I can't blame her. nationality? <laughs> <laughs> ain't got a clue. Maybe she's Swedish. <laughs> Swedish. Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, do you know the Swedish for chucking out time? That's 1.47. Oh, you right. down. Oh, you speak a bit of French, don't you? Well, potage bon fait. <laughs> They'll be pretending to know what he's saying when he's speaking French like. Listen, go and have a chat with you. See if she speaks a bit of French. Also, we all might anything for a mate. How much did you say these drinks were? One full. <laughs> On the house, Del. Ah, good. Well done, Mike. Good morning, gentlemen. <laughs> right, here we go. Uh, you can stay here if you like, Rodney. But you must be joking. What? You're going to speak French to someone who will miss this for a million pounds. <laughs> All right, then. All right, I'll show you. Come on, then. I'll sort you. All right, Maureen, I can take over. Uh, right. Au revoir. <laughs> <laughs> um, Parlez-vous de Francaise? Ah, oui, bien sûr. Pouvez-vous m'aider, s'il vous plaît? Est-ce qu'il y a un hôtel ou pension quelconque par ici où je peux trouver une chambre? <laughs> 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 Listen to me. I want you to ask her what her name is, you know, uh, where she lives, her address, and all that sort of thing, alright? Right, lead us to me. What is your name? I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm not, I'm not gonna make it, bro. Oh. Right, lead us to me. <coughs> what is your name? <laughs> what is your name? <laughs> what is your name? He's winding me up, eh? Does anyone speak English? English? You saucy <laughs> man. Of course we speak English. <laughs> we invented a lingo, didn't we, eh? Yes, we speak. Well, I speak English. You help me, maybe? I look for my hotel. Oh, right. Which hotel? What is the name of your hotel? I'm not sure of this. Oh, stunt me. There are bloody millions of them across the river. <laughs> Please? Oh, he said there are many hotels in London. Oh, yeah, many. You just come in then, Gatwick Airport, Silverbird. Please? He said, have you just arrived in England? No, I've been in England now for one year. I am language student, French and English, yeah? 
I work as au pair and study at the college. The family I work for tell me I must go. They are not happy with me. They say I must leave. So I have hotel, yes? Oh, yeah, yeah, don't worry. I, I will make sure you get to your hotel. I will make sure you get safely to your room. I think I can have this right now, don't you? Yeah, I bet you can. Yeah, go on, ah. Simon. <laughs> what, a, what a turn up, eh? He thought he was going to pull a Swede and she gets lumbered with a cabbage. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Albert, let's take a Toby home. We'll leave the keys of the car with the old saint here. There, off you go. Ta ta, darling. <laughs> Best of luck, girl. Keep your hand on your finnick. <laughs> No, all right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do, Michael. I'm going to leave the phone so you can think about it and I'll give you a bell on it in the morning, all right, son? So, um, have you any idea where your hotel is? I do not have hotel. But, but I thought you said you was looking for an hotel. Yeah, I look for a hotel. Oh, nice. There are no hotels in this area. Oh, this is what I think. So, I am nowhere. <laughs> oh, no, don't, don't cry. Oh, some it'll turn up. Just gives a bit of time to think. I have money. Oh, put that away. Well, I'm gonna chop your head off, Randy, if you got gold teeth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, this is a dangerous place, you know, at night. Streets are a bad place. Yeah, this is why I fear. Call time to go out now, please. Oh, um, look. Well, you could spend the night at our flat, I suppose. You know, if you want. I mean, it ain't very much, but, well, it's comfortable. Well, no, I'm really comfortable. <laughs> You're more than welcome. You know, you could have my bed. But where will you sleep? <laughs> Think of something, eh? <laughs> uh, should I take your case? Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> ah, that's why you got kicked That's why she got kicked out. I figured it had something to do with like her sleeping with the man in the house. Uh, now we see why she was kicked out. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Rodney. Uh, <laughs> she did a great job hiding it. She did an absolutely great job hiding it. And now you can't take it back. You thought you were thought you were finna get a girl, and yeah, <laughs> she's she's coming with baggage. <laughs> 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 Rodney finna have to play daddy. She not leaving that uh, flat, Rodney. But I feel like she is gonna be like very helpful with cleaning and cooking and things such as that. Either that or she's gonna make Rodney get her everything. But I think she's gonna be helpful. I think she's gonna be helpful. Uh, but <laughs> they flat not built to have a kid in it, so they gonna have to find us something. Uh, listen, Bistos, everybody's got a cordless telephone these days except you. What? Of course they're not faulty. <laughs> I say, cause they're not faulty. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Alright, oh, yeah, what? Did you, did you get that little bird home? Uh, yeah, yeah, I've got one. Um, so the thing is, Del, she didn't actually have an hotel to go back to. All right, Rodney, can't you jump on the phone? Yeah, yeah. what would you say? Go on. So I said she could spend the night here. Well, eh? What do you mean you can spend the night here? Oh. Come in, Anna. Right, yeah. Yeah, hello, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I've I got to go. Uh, I'll hang up because uh, something big has just turned up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Anna, this is my brother Derek. Del, this is Anna. Yeah. I... Good evening. Good evening. Yeah. And uh, that's her uncle Albert. Yeah. How do you do? Hello, dear. Nice to meet you all. <laughs> yeah, <I'm sitting laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, nice to meet you all. Put your bag down. I see. Good girl. Here you go. Do you fancy a bit of that? No, no, you're all right. We've already eaten. I took her down to Star of Bengal. Do you think a ruby was wise in her condition? <laughs> <laughs> excuse me, excuse us. Rodney, can I have a private word with you in private, please? 
Thank you. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Um, I won't be a minute, Anna. Albert, please uh, try to entertain our guests. <laughs> oh, no, no. Shut the door. Dill, I couldn't help it, honest. I mean, how was I supposed to know she was pregnant? <laughs> how was I supposed to know she was It doesn't take a Dr. Bleeding spot to work out what it was. Nah, really, you really can't blame Dale. Like, I mean, Rodney on this. He did it, though, and he couldn't take it back. He couldn't after he, he offered. I can't, get, I can't blame Rodney on this. Back tomorrow and I'll get her a room, mate. Yeah, Rocky, what happens if that sprog of hers decides to clock in tonight? Yeah, oh, no. yeah. I don't want to worry you two boys, but unless I'm very much mistaken, a young girl out there is up the duff. <laughs> you go out here in iceberg, Albert. <laughs> I just do not want to know what's happening to me lately. I just do not know what's happening. I've got more relatives crawling out of woodwork than Blake Carrington. And now I'm taking in the waifs and strays of Europe. Oh, yeah, well, that's why we got her help, isn't it? Because we're in a European community now. We've got to stick together. Pity her knees didn't. <laughs> <laughs> we have got room in the flat, haven't we? I mean, it's only one more person. Yeah, but it's one more person who's about to become two more persons. Facts. On the other hand, it could be twins or triplets or oh. quadrilets. Yeah, well, he's right and all, Rodney. I mean, she could be sitting out there with a belly full of people. She <laughs> <laughs> sitting out there with a belly full of people. <laughs> I mean, one hot bath and we could get chucked out for overcrowding. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Rodney, I'm sorry. No, we just... I cannot take the risk. Sorry, no. All right. All right, we'll chuck her out in the street, shall we? But you go and give it a good news, Dale. <laughs> Munch and glad back. <laughs> um, she... she... The thing is, uh, Anna, we've uh, hit a bit of a snack. See, see, oh, I, mean, well, I mean, at this Pacific moment in time, we are a bit um, knackered for space. Please? Say there is no room at the inn. Don't stole that Sunday school rubbish with me. <laughs> Und plonker, yeah? <laughs> He's calling me a. <laughs> Who did the dirty deed then? Yes. He says, who's the father? Oh, that's a bit personal. Yes, yes. a bit personal. Oh, father, yes, I understand. The family I work with, Mr. and Mrs. Wainwright, have son, Spencer, who is a student. Oh, One dang. day, Spencer returned from university with degree, yeah? I not drink, but this day I have the champagne. Then I am spinning, yeah? Then Spencer comes to my room. He wants to, to, uh, what word? Oh, you mean he wants to get home? Ah, day. To uh, what word? Oh, you mean he wants to get home? He wants to be my friend, yeah? Well, while you were still spinning. Yeah, I am still spinning. Then I find baby is here. I phone Spencer, and he say I must not tell his parents he is father. But this morning I am very worried, and I tell them. They say I lie. They say I am a bad person. Mr. Wainwright say my disruptive influence on Spencer makes it inexpedient for me to remain. Please. <laughs> For journey home. So why didn't you go? I cannot go yet. My family will see baby. This is not good. So I wait, and when baby is born, I give baby to people. <clears throat> well, um, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, you think so, sweetheart. Yeah. It's a terrible world, this is, isn't it? Really? Yeah, right. it's terrible. Um, look, the best thing you. <clears throat> why don't you chuck Anna's thing in, things in your room, you know, for tonight? Uh, oh, Anna, Anna, um, listen, you, you go with Rodney, see? 
through there and he will show you where you, you know, kick tonight, yeah? Thank you. It's all right. Come on, here, Gil. Here, come on, here, Gil. I knew Dale had a soft. Dale's a big softy. Dale's got a heart. I knew Dale would kick her out. I love it. Yeah, I'll take these. No, go on. You go. Go around. It's through, it's through there. Just That's it. Through that Open the door. Just take that. That's a good call. Just take that as well. Yeah, mind that. All right. All right. Good night now. Good night. Funny old world, isn't it? I mean, you take the thousands of couples around the world all trying to have kids. God. I remember my mate Nipper Townsend. Years and years, Jim and his wife dreamed of having a kid. They never did, though. No, nah, well, you've got to take so many things into account, haven't you, eh? You know, there's the temperature, the, the cycle, the tight pants, all that. <laughs> <laughs> Cork Snipper being stationed in mortar didn't help. <laughs> oh, my God. You seem to know a lot about all this medical malarkey. Mm? Yeah, well, I get it off Boise and Marley, don't I? You remember Boise, the second-hand car trailer? Yeah. Yeah, well, him and Marley, they've been trying to have a, a little sprog for years, but no joy. I mean, they've had more tests, you know, than the... There you go. You found the right people right there. You, you already got the people. Perfect situation. Absolutely perfect situation. So you just send them to Boise and Marley, let them house her until they had a kid, adopt the kid. Yeah, they're perfect. For years, but no joy. I mean... They've had more tests, you know, than the atom bomb. <laughs> Still no good. I mean, they tried to foster a dot, but... Yeah. I mean, funny that, aren't they? Funny. I mean, they're stinking rich, and yet with all that money, they cannot buy the one thing that... Oh, God, Dave. I thought it would be even so nice, but now Dale's gonna try to freaking sell the baby to him. He's gonna try to sell the girl and the baby to him. He always got to make sure he get a piece of the pot. Always got to make sure he gets some kind of profit. I already know what's coming. They would most dearly love. Little baby. Yeah, that's the way the cookie bounces, eh? <laughs> <laughs> cookie <Yeah>. bounces? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. What's wrong? <laughs> no, nothing. No, no, I just... Just worked out that everything could work out very, very cushy. Enjoy <laughs> <laughs> steak. Come on, joking. <laughs> they still got Duke. They still got Dookie with them. <laughs> oh, man. Say that again, Dill Boy. I said I could help you have a baby. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You're willing to be one of them suffragette fathers? <laughs> no, 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 no. What I mean is I know where there's a baby going. What? Knocked off? <laughs> no, no, no. It's all pucker. Huh? See, I know this German girl, right? Well, she's... She hadn't been in our green and pleasant land for no more than three months when she was suddenly taken pregnant. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it, Marley? In a little while from now, we could be awoken by the pitter patter of tiny jackboots. Boys, <laughs> 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 hey, you better know what I said. I know Marlene gonna be happy about the situation. Hey, y'all can't have a kid, boys. This is y'all couldn't adopt, y'all couldn't foster. This is a blessing falling into your hands. Brought up as yours, wasn't he? And anyway, the father is English. You see, this, look, the full story is Rodney met this girl in a public while ago. Hang on, Bell. You mean that dipstick Rodney's the father? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 of course he ain't, boy. See, leave it. What, Rodney? No, I mean, he don't know what it's all about yet. <laughs> Haven't you seen the funny way he still stirs his tea? <laughs> no. Rodney! Take your leg out that dog's mouth! <laughs> <laughs> Take your leg out that dog's mouth. I despair of that boy, I really do. Yeah, anyway, the father's kid is some sort of student geezer who's washed his hands of the old affair and, like, you know, he don't want to know. Well, him and me have got a lot in common because I don't want to know either. Oh, hang on a minute, boys. Let's not be hasty. I mean, you're the one who's always going on about having a son and heir. And it is a boy. I didn't think it had been born yet. She's had a scan. 
Oh. Let me show you something. Look, I uh, borrowed her passport so I could show you. Look, there's a picture of it here. Look, her name's Anna. She's a beautiful girl, isn't she? Of course, she's bound to have a handsome kid. And the student fella's father, right, is a very, very successful businessman. So the kid's gonna have everything, you know. Good looks, brains, business acumen. Just the sort of son and heir that you need for your second-hand car empire, Boise. Oh, <laughs> you can at least talk about it, Boise. Well, all right then, all right, love. Um, just give us a couple of minutes, will you, Del? <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> I think I've tired him out. <laughs> <laughs> Rascal. <laughs> <laughs> no, what are they doing? It's all right, all right, nothing. They're just having a bit of a chat. <clears throat> Go and get yourself a light ale and top me up while you're over there, all right? Uh, it is definitely a boy. Yeah, definitely a boy. What's all that about, eh? No, no, nothing. Uh, Boise's thinking of getting a boat and I'm going to get some equipment, see? Oh, that sort of boy. Yeah. Uh, this uh, German bird, is she healthy? Healthy? It's Boris Becker's cousin. <laughs> <laughs> What the bloody hell's going on here, Del? It's all right, Ronnie. It's all right. I'm always going to tell you. See, the uh, thing is, Boise and Marlene might have Anna's baby. <clears throat> what? What? Is this a raffle? <laughs> Del, this is a tiny human being we're talking about. This I... is flesh and blood. I... It's Anna's child. I know that, Rodney, but Anna wants it adopted and Boise and Marlene want to adopt. Yeah, well, if that's what they want, they go down to an adoption society. No, no we've but... tried lots of times, Rodney. They always turn us down. It's because of his record. Yeah. Boise did a little bit of a stretch when he was younger, you know. Yeah, we're full. Perjury. <laughs> <laughs> Embezzlement. <laughs> Conspiring to pervert the course of justice. <laughs> Fraudulent conversion of travellers' cheques and attempting to bribe the mayor of Lambeth. <laughs> just just little things. Just little things. No big deal. No reason to, to, to be denied for adoption. <laughs> So, I mean, it's any little thing, these adoption people. <laughs> Leave it out, Boise. With your record, I'm surprised we're allowed to keep a dog. <laughs> yeah, but it's all in the past. I mean, how many times have I got to repay my debt to society? Yeah, that's true. I mean, don't a person deserve a second chance? Well, yeah, yeah, that's fair enough. And that's exactly what we're going to give this little baby. A second chance. A chance to live in this beautiful house. A chance to have a loving father and a doting mother. And don't come more doting than that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, even Dookie's got a bib. <laughs> but it's illegal. What? Giving a little baby love and warmth and a chance in life is against the law. The welfare people, I mean, are they gonna wonder where Anna's baby is? It's obvious, isn't it? It's with his mother. Germany. I think we've cracked it at last, Boise. Well, you can tell everybody it's our own child. I mean, we're always reading in the papers about women giving birth who didn't even know they were pregnant. Might raise a few eyebrows, though. Well, yeah, but they're only neighbours. I was thinking more of that gynaecologist who examined you on Monday. <laughs> I swear to God! I swear to God! <laughs> oh, I'll never have to see him again, will I? Oh, just give us a minute, Dale. Come on, Boise. You're going to earn out of this, aren't you? How oh, dare you! It's a terrible thing to say. What sort of bloke do you think I am? I'm doing this for Anna and for them two. Most important of all, I'm doing it for that little unborn baby. I'm sorry. No, no, go on, don't no, touch I'm me. Sorry. No, go on, good, get out of here. <laughs> you are going to earn out of it, aren't you? Look, that is a cruel and callous jibe. How much is this going to cost? <laughs> <laughs> well, only her airline ticket home. And of course, money for the birth certificate and a few quid to cover our petrol and telephone calls. <laughs> Three grand should cover it, actually. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you knew they was gonna have to pay. 
do they with this? They might have gotten away with it. three grand, not much for a baby. See ya, tell boy. Shh. What is he? I'm busy. Gotcha, you Martian king. <laughs> What's up with you? You know perfectly well what's up with you. Selling a baby. God, it's like something out of Dickens' times. Rodney, listen, how many times has Boise tucked me up, eh? That free grand isn't for the baby, it's just, you know, payment for old debts. It's most probably for the best son. I mean, Anna gets her baby adopted by a loving family. It's right. Marlene gets the sprog she's always wanted. And you get free grand. Exactly, everyone's a winner. Yeah, <laughs> everyone. Well, except Dana. Au contraire, Rodney, au contraire. Because as soon as old Boise waves in with the poppy, I'm going to go straight down to Bureau Rocks to change, and I'm going to get a few hundred translated for her. So that means that Anna's going to go straight back to the fatherland with 300 drachma in her bin. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. This is no good. No bueno. Uh, not right now, She's Anna. in pain. How do you know you can't speak German? <laughs> this is it. This, this is, this is it. No, this, no, yes, no, yes, it's it not. Yes, it is. It's just it indigestion. Is not. It's not indigestion. Just hey, listen indigestion. to me. Listen to me. Go in the kitchen and get a glass of water. Go on. Right. Yes. That's it. Here, you ain't giving her Andrews, are you? Don't be a punker, no. <laughs> Look, well, I want you to get uh, from the hospital. Go on, get on the blower. And, oh, don't forget, call the maternity unit. All right. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, the lift. Yes, oh. deep breaths. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. <laughs> How the hell these phones work? Right, listen. When do, when, when do you start getting the pains, darling? They come this morning. This morning? Oh, it's all right. Don't worry, don't worry. You'll be all right now because the ambulance is going to come any minute, so you'll be all right. Don't worry. You just relax. Everything's going to be cushed in. <laughs> Well, it's all right, darling. Right. Danke. It's all right, it's all right. Four sprung the Dirk technique. <laughs> you can't help a little damn boy, man. You can't help it. You can't help it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Sit down, Marley. You're doing up the Wilton. <laughs> Sit down, Marley. We all know Anna's gonna wanna keep it. They're not getting the baby. Of course Anna's gonna wanna keep it. Like, she didn't think she wanted it until she hides it and decides that she wants to keep it. The baby's all right, Amy Dell. Yes, yes, Molly, for the umpteenth time, you're gonna have. Or, it's a baby girl. Or it's a baby girl. A beautiful, bouncing baby. <sighs> What's he weigh? Don't know, he hasn't stopped bouncing yet. <laughs> he hasn't stopped bouncing. He's, I don't know, about seven pounds on him. We've decided to call him Mark. Oh, that's handy, because his father's name was Spencer. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, the back, the back. He's here, they're here. All right, all right, all right, stay, all right. Don't, don't panic, stay there. It's all right, calm down. Calm down, it's all right. I'll, I'll... Everything all right, Rogers? No, everything is not bloody all. Marley, are you already? Yeah, you told yeah. him about a little boy. What, what, what about him? What about him being a little girl? No. <laughs> I knew it. I, I knew it. I absolutely. <laughs> but I, I feel like she's going to want to keep it. Uh, also. News yet. I mean, how could Anna do that to me? I mean, after all I've done for it. So what's wrong then? Oh, well, for one, Anna has fallen in love with her baby. But the most She's course, done what? Now she can't do that to me. Of course. Me. And she can't do Look, a deal is a deal. Yeah, I know that deal, but I'm asking you. Alright, let's sort it out. Get in, get in. Alright, Albert, alright, I'll sort it out. Here she is. Oh, hello, sweetheart. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. Oh, good. Here, let me take... I think maybe things are not cushy. Hmm? I think maybe now I keep baby. No, 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 you can't do that, darling. No, 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 because, you know, we'll have the VAT people around here. Um, <laughs> just come, come in, I'll explain everything. Go on, you go in there. That's it, darling. Go on. In you go. Put the baby Put the baby down. Oh, uh, first of all, um, these are the very nice people who are going to um, 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 look after your baby. There they are. Someone upset her? No, no, no. 
nose. You just got, you know, like baby blues, that's oh, all. Yeah, just, just, just a minute, boys. Just a minute. I'm going to have to come clean, you see. It's a, <clears throat> the thing is, it's about your little baby boy. He ain't. Ain't what? Well, he ain't a little baby boy. What is it, then? <laughs> <laughs> He's such a... What is it? A girl! <laughs> Baby girl, isn't it, eh? A girl? Yeah. But you said she didn't escape. I know, I know what said, I told you. you. All right, boss, I know I told you it was going to be a girl, it ain't. I mean, just keep your money, the deal's off, all right? Well, what it's a boy or girl? Oh, twins, it's a baby! What? All right, Marlene, we'll take it. <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? Everything you buy off him's got something missing. <laughs> Like that. What else could I do? No good asking me, son. I'd never flogged a baby before. Well, you know, I was, I was doing it for Anna, wasn't I? You know, I, was, I wasn't trying to help. What do you want? Applause? So, oh, bossy, sorry, no, sorry, mate. Listen, the deal's off. You, it's off, all right? Is that right, Del? The deal's off, is it? Yeah. Too bleeding right, it's off. Well, what are you talking about? Not predict, man. I just I see that one go. That one got me. That one. <laughs> it's a little black baby girl. <laughs> Deals off. Deals off. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's uh, the other thing I meant to tell you, Al. You see, Spencer's mummy and daddy come over here in 1956 <laughs> in the West Indies. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, it don't bother me, boy, see? Leave off, mommy. <laughs> the baby's brown. <laughs> so is Duke. <laughs> so is Duke. <laughs> but I ain't claiming to be Duke's father. <laughs> Like me, so. <laughs> we could say it's a throwback. For God's sake, Marlene. I might be able to con people into buying my cars. I might be able to convince them that you conceived and gave birth in seven days flat, but how the hell am I going to persuade them my granddad was Louis Armstrong? <laughs> Suggestion. You can subscribe to Patreon or drop it in the comment section. It's your boy Dino. Out.